Hi guys, thought I'd send you another story. Hope you're all doing well. Um, we're going to do Anna's allotment bake. Okay, Anna's allotment bake, because I know it's a favorite. I know it's a favorite, so I want it to be out there so that you can all have a watch and a listen whenever you want to. Are we ready? Anna, shouted Pete. I'm off to the allotment. Are you coming? It's going to be really overgrown. I've not been for ages. Come in, she said. Wow. How do we get through this lot? How do we get through this lot? Just push your way through it, said Pete. Just push your way through it, said Pete. Phew, we're through. Now let's get the mud off of our hands. Now, I'm going to make some holes in the ground, said Pete, and I want you to follow me. Shaking in the seeds. Can you hear those seeds? Shaking in the seeds. Shaking in the seeds. Look, there's some carrots that I sowed a few months ago and they're ready to be poured up. Are we ready? Let's get my carrot guys. This is a bit fiddly and pull. They're ready to be poured up and pull. It was time to head home as it was getting dark. Is that an owl that I can hear? Said Anna, can you hear that owl? It's quite faint, guys. Is that an owl that I can hear? Said Anna. When they got home, Anna asked if she could bake a carrot cake. Carrot cake. Great idea said Pete and he helped Anna pop on her apron he helped Anna pop on her apron they grated 300 grams of carrots popped it into the mixture and gave it a really good stir a really good stir and gave it a really good stir Pete popped it into a very hot oven, but after a while, Anna became impatient. Is it ready yet? She said, just as the timer went off. Just as the timer went off. Mmm, smell that gorgeous carrot cake. Deep breath, everyone. Smell that gorgeous carrot cake. High five to the gardener and high five to the chef. Fabulous. Good listening. Thank you for joining me for the story. That was Anna's allotment bake. See you later.